Hello, everybody. Today is Sunday, March the 28th, 2021. Welcome back to another weather video. Today, it's going to be a little short video. We're going to be talking about the temperatures upcoming for this week, and we're going to be talking about the upcoming severe weather threat possibly for Wednesday. So today we did have our severe weather. Um, we just had a thunderstorm here in South Carolina that went through about a couple hours ago. It was very windy, a lot of heavy rain, a couple of thunder and lightning, but it wasn't as bad. We did have a severe thunderstorm warning for our area, but it wasn't that bad. The wind was blowing all day. Like, let me tell you, the wind was blowing so hard all day, like constant winds at 30 miles per hour, pretty much the whole day until the cold front moved through our area. And now it ain't even windy outside anymore. It's like, okay, so it was windy all day, but now it don't want to be windy anymore. So that's kind of interesting. But let's get into this video. Now, tonight is going to be fine. Tomorrow's going to be a very nice day. The sun will return finally, and we'll begin some sunshine. Temperatures will be in the 60s. Um, Tuesday, we do have some rain coming into the Florida Panhandle, southern Georgia, back into Louisiana, Mississippi, Arkansas, and that will lead to our next upcoming severe weather threat, possibly on Wednesday. So as we look at Wednesday, you can see a lot of greens, a lot of yellows. So that means that we're going to have some heavy rain, and that means we might have some thunderstorms. And we might even have some snow up there in the Northeast in, on the first day of April, too, April the 1st. We might have some snow into New York, Pennsylvania, down into West Virginia and Southwest Virginia. So we'll have to keep our eyes peeled for that. A lot of heavy rain into South Georgia and Southern, um, Southeastern North Carolina. And then we have this trough digging and that's going to bring a lot of cooler air. I mean, we're talking about temperatures in the 50s for our area in South Carolina. And it's April. April and we're in the 50s. That is some very chilly air for April. So a, a brief cold period is probably going to be cold for about two days. And then a warm back up into the 70s and the 80s. So it won't be that bad. It'll just be cold for a brief little period. So speaking of the cold temperatures, let's go to the temperature outlook. So here's the temperature outlook. Um, it's pretty chilly up there in the northern part of the U.S. Tomorrow we're going to be in the 60s and the 50s for temperatures of warm air going all the way up into the Dakotas and Minnesota. They're in the 60s, even some parts in the 70s. Some areas in the northeast are Ain't even going to get up 50 degrees. It's going to be very chilly in the northeast, so bundle up. Um, then the warm air, that ridge, moves into the eastern U.S., bringing some warm temperatures, 60s and the 70s for the Carolinas, Florida's bacon in the 90s, the 90s. Wow. I wish I was in Florida right now, but I'm not. And there's a lot of warm air into Georgia. We're in the 70s and the 80s for Georgia's. Not for Georgia, for Texas. They're in the 70s and the 80s. My bad. Then we have some cooler air coming into Minnesota and North Dakota. So, yes. Then we're going to speed it up until Thursday. Thursday is when it gets very cool. Look at how far this cold air goes all the way south. We're talking about northern Georgia, northern Alabama, not even getting up to 50 degrees for a high temperature. Here in South Carolina, we're going to be in the 50s, the low 60s, even some upper 40s. So it's going to be a, a chilly day on Thursday. Get your coats, not your coats, get your jackets, sweatpants, sweatshirts, all that stuff for Thursday. Same thing as Friday. The cooler air moves a little bit to the east. So northern Alabama, northern Georgia is going to be in the 50s, not the 40s. We have the 40s for the mid-Atlantic, um, the northeast in the 30s and the 20s. Oh, 
that is some cold air for April. So yeah, find a jacket, get your jacket like I'm wearing and just be bundle up because it's going to be very, very chilly outside. Anyway, that was it. Hopefully the severe weather event, these severe weather events don't be as bad as they were this month. This month we had a lot of severe weather events. So next month it might get worse. I'm hoping that it doesn't. But thank you for watching this video. Make sure to subscribe and like if you enjoyed it. And I will see you tomorrow, Monday, March the 29th, 2021. Good night.